Hey Chronicles, so today we will be farming Orly Network. I found a pretty good strategy which we will be farming three projects in one. You guys know that I love this type of strategy so we can add as many projects as possible within one transaction. So Orly Network is a order book technology. So that means for us to get involved with it, we need to be using an application that is using their technology. So take for instance, like bridges using the layer zero technology or some projects using um, Pith network. So basically the same thing. We need to be using any type of application that is already using the order book from orderly network. So we need to go to log X. And by the way, before I start with log X, there is a quest for orderly network. You guys know that some people made some pretty good amount of money from the quest on Menta. So make sure that you're not fading it. Uh, pretty simple. You just need to be using LogX. Obviously, we have the social task, which is liking, following and everything else. And then you guys need to be adding some volume. There are three steps. The first one is $500 in volume. Next on the list is 5,000. And lastly, it is 15,000. So depending on the amount of volume that you add, you will be receiving a different NFT. Also, we have until February 17 to add this type of volume. So that's a good thing. We still have time. We can get involved with it and obviously form multiple projects at once. So number one, you're going to need some funds on LogX or well, on Arbitrum first. By the way, you will need some USDC for that. Um, so make sure that you send some USDC and also you have some ETH for your gas fee. Once you're here, then you can go ahead and deposit some funds by clicking this. You do deposit and then you're going to select your account. You should have orderly and hyper liquid. So first, first step is go to the quest. Come here, click on it so it can send you directly to LogX so you can create an orderly account. I'm going to be adding the link for that in the description, but also before taking any type of transaction on LogX, also make sure that you follow the link in the description so you can also create an account for Hyperliquid because you should not be able to do it within LogX. So you first need to create the account for orderly and then the account for Hyperliquid. Again, I'm going to be adding the link for each one of them. Once you're set up and you have your USDC, just click here. Go to deposit, use either orderly or hyper liquid, or you can divide your funds into both of them. So maybe $100 into orderly, $100 into hyper liquid. Once we're done, we can go ahead and take a transaction. So for us to specify where we are going to be adding our volume, we can do, for example, source. Then we can choose orderly. If not, then we can choose hyper liquid. So if I take a transaction right now on hyper liquid using the source, it will automatically add that volume into hyper liquid for me. And by the way, you guys know that hyper liquid is tokenless. Orderly is tokenless, but LogX is also tokenless. So we are farming three projects in one. Let me go ahead and first start with orderly. We can take any type of position. So right here, I'm just going to do like $50. I'm going to increase my leverage to maybe 5x. I'm just going to do a long just for a test. And there we go. Now we have a position open for orderly. We can also check our trades right here and it will show on that it, it has been taken for orderly right here. And also right here, it is showing orderly. Now, if I go and open a position for Hyperliquid, same process. I only have $24 on a Hyperliquid, but I'm going to do the same. First, we're going to be approving. We sign and then we're going to be opening a transaction. And as I said, the volume will show automatically. So let's go ahead and first check my volume on Hyperliquid. It says 20K723. So let's go long. And in just a second, it should come here directly on Hyperliquid. Let me go ahead and refresh. All time. So as you can see now, I have more volume on Hyperliquid. So it is adding it automatically for you. You don't need to do anything. And again, Hyperliquid is tokenless. There is only like 35,000 users on Hyperliquid. 
and also the point system is until March. So most likely after March, we should be receiving the airdrop for Hyperliquid. Logex, they have been hinting the airdrop. They even have a tab right here for airdrops and orderly also. And there is the task and everything else. Make sure that you also check on orderly network to see if there is any other type of task that you should be doing or you could be doing. Again, make sure that you do all of them because we never know how much money we can receive from them. And basically that's it, nothing else. Make sure that you're tracking your volume. You guys know that I already have a tracker. Um, there is a link in the description for it. If not, at least use a piece of paper and start adding your transactions so you know when you started using Orderly, when you started using Hyperliquid, how much volume you have on LogX, so on and so forth. So hopefully this was helpful enough. If you have any questions, any doubts, just let me know in the comment section. And as always, thank you for watching, guys. Take care.